1130. Do you know where your music fest is? Well, we are under the bridge at Wells Fargo Fest Plots, live from Camp SEN. Of course, this is the preview show, kicking off just a half hour before the fest starts at noon. I am John Lunger, and today I'm joined by Aiden Bloomfield. Aiden, thanks so much for coming down early for us. Thanks for having me, guys. Yeah, now, uh, we were talking a little bit before. You've already played a set at the festival, and it was something a little different. It was pretty cool. You did a, a, a Jeff Buckley set? Yeah, I did a little tribute to Jeff Buckley. He's one of my biggest inspirations as a musician, and I was playing in one of the theaters over at Arts Quest yeah, Saturday. Yeah, Guitar Lyric yeah. Class, yeah. And uh, I, was, I just wanted to do something different than I usually do. So I, I decided to do something that was a little more raw and organic like Jeff Buckley style so I that's really cool yeah something like that you know yeah and how did it go <laughs> I thought it went well good I thought it went well I tried to add a fifth song to the set list I thought I would need five so I added one last minute and uh, I hadn't played it for years but I was like I'm just gonna try I yeah, got it a, I need another what a good time to just and try then it I did it and that's the one I posted on my Instagram oh, so it worked out cool. it was fun very cool. Well, you're, you have a couple of songs for us today, yeah. and you have an upcoming set at the fest yet as well, I right? Tonight. Tonight. Yeah. Fantastic. Tonight, 6.30 on the Town Square stage Very in the cool. south side. At Seal Stacks. Yeah. Well, I'll tell you what. Why don't you kick us off with a couple of songs this morning, and it's almost like uh, your rehearsal for tonight's set at Seal Stacks. All right, cool. All right, take it away. Sweet. Aiden Bloomfield.
This heart of mine keeps decent time. Oh, my ears may be weak, my eyes may be all but blind. I still have sense enough to feel that I'm not much without you near. But I paid my dues. I've loved one or two. Still keeps boiling down to you. Just choose to be my victory or vice. Either way, I still want you here tonight. You never know, it's hard to find another. Oh. Hell no, it's got a home for folks like me. Cause there will come a day, there will come a day, when the earth will cease to spin. Hold me close and say, My God, where have you been? Well, I've been around. Happily lost, but oh, so easily found. They're counting the stars above the hill. Need some old moon on in my tune. I'll see you soon. In Bloomfield, ladies and gentlemen. Aiden, that was awesome. Thanks, man. Yeah, I mean, you, uh, you've got such a distinctive voice, and it kind of, like, it's an old soul, you know? It, like, it, like, harkens back to, like, it almost, it's funny, we're the 40th year of Music Fest, right? And we talk about some of those amazing folk singer-songwriters. Don McLean, as an example, is one of the first headliners in 84, and it just, it had that vibe, and I loved it, and I can't thank you enough for yeah, coming on today. Thank you for having me. Thanks. Yeah, I had absolutely. a lot of fun. Now, you were talking earlier, you, you're gigging year-round, full-time. Full you're going to have like 160 shows this year yeah. under your belt when all is said and done. I've played about 100 so far. Wow. So the rest of my year is booked. This upcoming weekend, I'm off. It's one of two for the rest of the year. Holy cow, man. And then every other weekend, my dates are online. ABCHighway.com. It's Aiden Bloomfield and Concrete Highway is my band. So oh, cool. ABC Highway. I figure that's easy to remember. It totally, totally, absolutely oh. is. You know, you're playing a gorgeous Martin guitar Thanks. too, and we had uh, we had them on the show a couple days ago. We're doing so much with them. We're giving away ten Martins this year. You can enter to win at MusicFest.org. It's right on the homepage. There's no reason to not throw your hat into the ring because they are the absolute best. They're great guitars. I've been playing this one since probably I think I bought it in 2015. Okay. And it's been my main gigging guitar it's this or i have a i have an acoustic uh semi-acoustic les paul it's awesome yeah. i'll bring that out yeah. but this is my this has seen hundreds of gigs over the years wow. it's got it's got its little marks on it from wear and tear that's love that's not wear and tear yeah. that's just love have and you I done the it. tour in nazareth have you I been have. to the factory yeah i actually went um i went a couple months ago, I was actually over there. First so time. cool, yeah, right? It was awesome. I love yeah. it. Yeah, and you can too. Uh, you know, just check it out. Go to the Martin Guitar website. Uh, it's right up the street in Nazareth. There's no reason not to, and it is so cool to see them do that. Um, Aiden, you're playing tonight, six o'clock, Steel Stacks on the Air Products Town Square. Make sure you check that out. We already covered the website, but let's talk about tonight's show. What What are you playing? Give us a hint of the set list. So, on Saturday, I did that Jeff Buckley tribute. I wanted to be. I feel like as a performing musician, you're trying to find the balance between being an artist and an entertainer right? and a musician. Yeah. So Saturday I was the artist, tonight I'm trying to be more of the entertainer. I like to do a lot of guitar looping. Oh, cool. So when you find me at my gigs, I'll do a lot more lead guitar and I'll loop rhythm and I'll loop a bass line and then some percussion and then solo over that. So 
Tonight I'll be doing some blues tunes. I love the blues, classic rock. I love grunge music, so I'll do some Soundgarden stuff. Chris it's Grinnell. an eclectic set list, which is perfect Big for mix. music fest, yeah. right? That's like, what I try to do. Yeah. So. That's awesome. Well, Aiden, thank you so much for joining us today. All of you out there, if you're coming down to the fest today, the best way to keep track of things and not miss things, like Aiden said, is download that app powered by PNC. Make your own schedule. Find Aiden on there. Like him. That'll help promote his show even more, too. Uh, thank you all for tuning in. Don't go anywhere. We have so much more on our preview show here live at Camp SEN under the bridge at Wells Fargo Fest Plots. It's Tuesday at Music Fest. It's beautiful out. Don't go anywhere. We will see you in just a minute. Hey, can I have your island noodles? Uh, as if. A picturesque view of the Monocacy Creek live here in Bethlehem under the bridge at Wells Fargo Fest Plots at Camp SEN. This is the preview show. Music Fest starts today at noon as it does every day. I am John Lunger here at Camp SEN with my good friend Juliet Vestal from Bibron. Juliet, thank you so much for uh, coming down and, and chatting with us today. Well, thanks for having me. Bibron, a proud local company, uh, a sponsor of the fest for, for many, many years. Why, why is it uh, something that Bibron puts importance on and helps support? So we uh, focus on our patients for most of the year, and then or for all of the year, and then uh, for the 10 days of Music Fest, this is a, a wonderful opportunity to get back to the community and also to uh, involve our, our uh, employees and, and invite them to, to come down and enjoy it. Yeah, and it's so cool to see, uh, you know, groups of coworkers come down, often volunteer together, enjoy the festival, because everybody does it a little differently, right? Like, uh, some people walk down, some people drive, some people only go to Steel Sticks, some people only go to the north side. How do you like to attack the fest? Well, I like to start on the south side. Okay. So I love the main stage, and it, you know, truth be told, it's closer to my house, so okay. and it's easy to get to. That's true. But we love to go over there and just um, Levitt Pavilion and Levitt Lawn, and and always to see what's happening there. So that's usually where we start. Yeah, it, it, it's so interesting that we have these two campuses on the festival, and they each kind of have their own vibe, right? Like, uh, neither one is better; they're just different. It's just kind of like the difference between leader plots and fest plots. It's still music fest, but a different kind of vibe. Yeah. What's your go-to food situation? Because I have to eat right after this show because <laughs> i got to go work the rest of the day. Well, and this is convenient because I get to go get lunch before I go back to the office. Oh, but I, I would that. So I would say my, my go-to food is all shucks. Okay. How many, how many ears are you going for this so, year? So only one, but I okay. look at it like it's still a vegetable, but okay. you, get, you get the good seasoning on it. So that, that's why I like I it. I love that. And... Uh, Sneaking vegetables into the fest diet uh, is something that I, I've always struggled with over the years. But I got to tell you, this year, we've got more vegetarian and vegan options than I think we've had in the history of the festival. And it's very, very exciting. And at Steel Stacks in particular, uh, they have a, an amazing vegan flatbread with uh, vegan meat from Butterhead Kitchen in Easton. Uh, there is Tri Vegan, a vendor where their entire menu is vegan. Uh, and we've been uh, all eating it to kind of, you know, keep ourselves uh, in, in good shape and try to, to not have as much fried things. Uh, and it's just been, uh, you know, a delight. But I'm with you with the corn. Well, and, and I think it's just great because you can come down here, listen to music, and then eat your way through the festival, right? Yeah, I mean, look at me. I clearly, uh, <laughs> I've been doing this for long enough that uh, I literally wear it, right? Uh, that's hilarious. Uh, do you know my pro tip for aw shucks? No. Do you know they sell the seasoning? Oh, they do? Yeah, oh, you can okay. buy the seasoning from them, and it is great on everything. Year-round, I put it on my eggs. I love the Oshuk seasoning and eggs, and then that's my pro tip for all of you out there too. Yeah. Absolutely, get the ear of corn, but ask them about that seasoning too, and take it home. It'll change your life. See, that's what I love about Music Fest. You learn something new every year. So, that's, I mean, it's the least I could do. Uh, have you seen any shows that you loved this year? I was at Walker Hayes last night. 
What an incredible night. It, it was well worth the, the rain delay and what was super well handled and he just he did an amazing show. Yeah, and we were so grateful. The tour was so awesome to work with and it was a powerhouse performance. Uh, one of the best things that happened yesterday happened actually Walker Hayes on social media. He does trick shots at all of his different tour dates and we have a basketball hoop backstage and he made like a half court shot over a bus uh, behind the stage at Music Fest and he, he sent it out today and we're like, man, he had fun and it was clear on the show, but we have even more proof because he made a trick shot. Man of many talents. Oh my gosh, you are not kidding. Well, I know you've got to get lunch before you get back to the office. We want to thank you and everyone at Bron for their continued support of the festival because, of course, it takes a community to put Music Fest on. We're talking about all of the businesses that help support the festival, the volunteers, the members, the sponsors, and the festival goers and people like you that are watching at home. It takes all of the Lehigh Valley to make this happen, and we really thank you for your support. Thank you. We also thank you. Do not go anywhere. When we come back, it's, uh, I, I can't believe they let me do it, but I get to be on television with uh, Patrick Brogan, the Chief Programming Officer at ArtsQuest. Don't go anywhere. Back in just a minute with even more here on SEM. <laughs> Back to the Future opening here because we're celebrating 40 years of Music Fest. Of course, the fest kicked off in 1984, and here we are doing the 40th edition of the best fest in the land. John Lunger live here under the Bridget Wells Fargo Fest plots at Camp SEN. Uh, and against everyone's better judgment, they once again. Here we uh, are. They let Patrick Brogan come on live television. Let's go. With let's me. do this, John. Let's, let's do it. Let's make him regret it. Let's make him regret it. Let's do our best. It. Let's make everyone uncomfortable. No. Uh, <laughs> Jokes aside, you're the chief programming officer. You lead the team uh, that books the festival. So I'm just dying to know, what have you seen that's blown you away this year? I've loved everything. I've, I've loved almost everything, other than the story last night. I've loved everything yeah, we're, we're seeing. Gonna, let's not talk the, about uh, that. Uh, I'll tell you, a couple great highlights for me were on the main stage this year already. AJR uh, and uh, Walk the Moon the first couple nights. Great shows. Walker Hayes last night. Uh, a lot of fun shows on the main stage so far. And very cool stuff, too, as part of the 40th anniversary. We had a concert with the Bach Choir, something right. that uh, the early music fests had every single year, so a nice throwback there. Uh, and of course, who could forget Cast and Bronze? Cast and Bronze was back yeah. with, with crowds as large as ever of course. Uh, filling the area, and he unmasked this year at the end of the show. So that was uh, quite a quite a delight for the audiences to get to see the man behind the mask. Very, very dramatic. Uh, I've been saying for years you should be wearing the mask yourself, Patrick. <laughs> uh, but that's okay. Someday, maybe we'll get there. Maybe. I did. Maybe. I also enjoyed. We uh, speaking of 40th mm -hmm. uh, celebrations. Uh, our sister city in Schwäbisch Gmünd, Germany, mm -hmm. uh, sent a delegation as well as a band, and I enjoyed uh, the sounds of Dizzy B, uh, who uh, a four-piece rock band, party yeah. rock band. Our audience very familiar with Dizzy B. They saw it live on SEN. Yep. Super, super fun, uh, and I think they sing in English better than I speak in English. <laughs> That's uh, for sure. Which I guess is a pretty. We wonder low about bar. that some days. Yeah, too. it's yeah. it's true. But yeah, that was really really cool. Uh, I know uh, the delegation uh, was just blown away. Uh, by Music Fest, and in fact, one of them mentioned, you know, like, hey, it's funny that you got inspiration from Germany because 40 years later, we're back here and we're gonna take so much inspiration from Music Fest. And it's just a full circle moment, uh, really kind of just showing how there is nothing like this festival anywhere. The way that the, the music uh, and foods and community come together to celebrate uh, our, our, our history of the festival as well as uh, the fabric of who we are. It's, it's an exciting festival and uh, another great one here this year. It is, and we're uh, kind of about halfway through, so tons of music left. So before we kick off the fest today, we got to know what is on your must-see list for coming up. For through, today? For, for today, we're talking, for the we got, rest of the well, festival. Sure, today we have uh, Go Go Gadget back here on Fest Plots. That'll be right here on SEN. That'll be ridiculous in the best possible a way. A lot of fun, a lot of fun. It's yeah. uh, bringing the Jersey Shore right here to Fest Plots. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we have and it's not just you in a tank top and like going tanning for once. As it's much actually... as as much as fun that would be yeah, uh, for audiences, true. I'm sure. Uh, and then uh, uh, Rubik's Cube, uh, nice. great 80s uh, party band. 
uh, is playing at America Plots tonight. Uh, Scythian as well. Uh, the PNC stage at the Plots, which has got to be the best view of the festival. I, un, 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 the gorgeous backdrop of uh, the South Side, the South Mountain. Mm -hmm. It's a, a, a beautiful view. And then uh, coming well, up. Hey, hold on. Oh, I've got good news about go. that Scythian show. Uh, uh, it's what is gonna, it? It's going to be live on SEN2. Oh. So if you can't make it down, you can still see Scythian because, of course, it's the best live coverage. It's the only live coverage. It's the exclusive live coverage of Music Fest. All the stages of the festival. Yeah, right, it's right it's here in your home. Incredible. It's incredible. And us uh, yeah. to start your day with. Let's talk about the main stage tonight because there's a pretty cool thing happening. We've got R&B on the main stage. We We've got Keith Sweat and Monica tonight. That's right. Uh, tickets available? Tickets still available okay. for tonight. Cool. Uh, John, 26 different keyboards will be on stage tonight uh, to make the sounds of Monica and Keith Sweat That happen. feels like you're messing with me. I'm not. I, there, there are literally 26 different keyboards uh, that'll be on the main stage tonight. I, I'm not. I'm not I'm making this up. I, you just melted my brain a little bit. I don't know how to recover from there that. There are four different. And now and they're, they're split. I think uh, uh, Monica has 14 and, and Keith Sweat has 12. Okay, that makes it slightly better, but that's still crazy. Uh, I think we're in for an amazing show, if that's the case. Going, going to be a blockbuster. Uh, Monica, uh, an icon, Keith mm -hmm. Sweat, uh, in the R&B world, we're, we're looking forward to that show. And, and tickets still available, as you mentioned, for tonight's show Okay. Uh, with the two of them. And, and tickets still available for most shows on the main stage, though we do have a couple that are either close yeah. to or about to sell out. Yeah, the Goo Goo Dolls, I think there are less than 100 tickets yes. left uh, yeah. in ti in, on that so show. So those will be gone today. Yeah, and for Train, train too. If you're looking to go to Train on closing night, that that one is 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 really going quick as well. And the weather looks great for tonight and tomorrow night yeah. for both these shows. So it's gonna be uh, just amazing. Hey, we paid for it yesterday, so we might as well <laughs> right. enjoy it today, right? It's gonna be a gorgeous day. Um, we've only got like a minute left, so I okay. gotta know uh, what you eating today, buddy. What am I eating? I know what I'm I, eating today. What are you eating today? Uh, you I haven't told them probably. No, I haven't told oh, them actually. I'm gonna go to uh, my favorite Cumano Express. Uh, uh, I was talking to the guy. Talking to the guy today, he's like, "Hey, I've got a, I've got a, I've got a, a Cubano bowl that you got to try." A bowl, I haven't had uh, that. Pair. And he he was very excited about it. So I'm gonna literally sign off, and I'm gonna uh, hustle over there. Hustle. Uh, and I'm gonna I'm gonna yeah, hustling hustling for me. Relative. Is not, it's a relative yeah, term. Yeah, hustling for uh, me is like a, a slow walk <laughs> for most normal people. So Aki, yes, the the tacos at uh, at Zinz and Pots. So Pots, good. So delicious. Mm -hmm. And I think I have not had a uh, a bratwurst yet, uh, or a Krainerwurst is my favorite. I'll tell you what, why don't we wrap up, we'll go to Carl Amers, and let's Lady and Tramp uh, uh, a bratwurst together. Not like, going to happen today. You don't want to? Uh, Not going right. to happen today. I shot anything. my shot. He turned me down. Don't go anywhere. Music Fest starts in just mere moments here on SEN. Thank you for watching. We'll see you down here at the fest.